be joined by Mike and Chester from the very big band in the world. It is Linkin Park. Thanks so much for joining us. Do you realize that we never do interviews with just the two of us anymore? I know. This is an exclusive. It's yeah. a, this is a big friggin' deal. The other guy, usually we split everything into to pairs. Why is that? Did, because did we, can, we can cover more, you know, we can cover more oh. ground. Six guys in the band, you do me and like Brad and Chester and Joe and then Rob and Dave. Some, some, some mix of those those groups but yep. today how does it feel we're back together talking about yourselves it's you know there's really nothing my... there's really nothing better to talk about <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Well, I was, I was going to talk about something completely different let's talk about the Spice Girls um, just what <laughs> yeah let's have you, have, you thought, have you thought about dude doing something 20, with the Spice they sold Girls? out like what Wembley in like 20 seconds or something like that that's pretty that's pretty awesome. You know, that's amazing that you actually followed that information I had no I, idea that they were even playing a show it was an ac accidentally yeah, okay. We've That's all cool. got a soft spot. Who was, who's That's your cool. favorite? Um, you Which know, one of them? Yeah. I always thought that uh, that Ginger was kind of hot, and then I realized that she wasn't. And I was like, <laughs> what was wrong with me? Didn't she get hotter? That Didn't she get hotter, though? She like, well, her body got, got better. She, she, got, she got hotter, and then something happened to her face. I don't know what happened <laughs> to her face. Well, you know, things happen. And something happened Something happened to your arm as well on this very tour indeed. And that is the sexiest looking cast I've sexy, ever seen. It is sexy, isn't it? Sleek, dude. You know, I, I, I have to do everything with some kind of style. Um, it's, a blade, it's some Blade Runner shit. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You know, I don't think they make these in the United States. I think they only make them out here in Australia. Really? But, uh, yeah, you have to get a big plaster one that, you know, ends up stinking and you have to take the hanger and stick it down. Yeah, and you got all your friends to sign it. Yeah. There's none of that with that one. No, no, none of that with this one. Um, yeah, I, was, uh, I uh, you know, attempted to jump off the riser. I, I do it every night, you know, and uh, this one went horribly wrong and uh, somehow... I went from jumping into just looking like I was a rag doll being flung out of a moving vehicle um, and hit the <laughs> ground with my, with my arm out, like, you know, behind me like this and just kind of everybody's kind of watching. It. Everybody's watching the replay, well, not the replay, but the, the, some fan footage of that, that jump It'd be online. Got taken. Yeah, it's great. I mean, it's a great shot of it, too. It's, it's really, really close. Funny and you can dude. see him, like, you know, flail out into midair. He's his <laughs> feet are five feet up, so his actual head is like, you know, eleven, eleven. I don't, I don't know what that converts to. It's a couple <laughs> meters. You guys use friggin' okay. three anyway. Meters. So it's a long it's, way. It's yeah, three meters plus. I was about, I was up about in the air. this much higher and, than and he Mike's head. Goes like this and flies down and hits the ground, and you can see him get up, and his adrenaline's going, and he's like, ugh, and he's like <laughs> trying to sing and do his thing. And as you watch, if you watch carefully, you see the adrenaline start to wear off and he starts missing words because there's like flashes of pain and he's like, You're, oh, oh, <laughs> oh, what do I do? And he starts kind of trying to like shake it off and it's not working and he realizes it's broken. Before we talk about Spice Girls, but Sienna Miller is clearly hotter than any of the Spice Girls really put together. Pretty much, yeah. Yeah. Okay, I'm, glad we, I'm glad we covered that off. Now, um, let's talk about your year as well, Chester, because you also had this horrendous intestinal drama early on in the year where you thought you were, you know, you were in ridiculous pain and then no one actually worked out what the problem was. Oh, no, 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 that was, that was a few years ago. Was that a few years ago? That was years ago, yeah. We actually, but I mean, to put it in perspective, I, I actually... should have looked through the date on that. I made him a shirt that said... He, I promised Chester a shirt and I just finally made it the other day because all the, like, stuff that's happened to him, I made him a shirt that says, Why me? <laughs> and it's, it's pretty it's, awesome. He, uh, he just totally deserves the shirt because the guy has had... He had that intestinal thing. Yeah. He has had multiple problems with his back and stomach. He, and usually we don't cancel any dates for most of this stuff. Like we've only canceled, I think we've canceled probably less than five dates in our whole career, mm. ever. And that's because the dude just is used to getting broken and powers through it. <laughs> <laughs> and he's broken his hand twice and broken he got 21 wrist. stitches up his arm. And we started uh, Project Revolution and this, uh, year. this year, just a few months ago, Huge I had problem. meningitis. I got meningitis really? right the, before we left. The two days before we I was like, the first I was show. Like, I was like, oh, I kind of feel like I've got the flu. And like two hours later, I was like, I can't open my eyes because like everything hurts so bad. Convulsing on the floor. <laughs> and um, that was the most pain all over my whole body that I've ever experienced.
And uh, in the States, you did a really big tour, Project Revolution, which is kind of your own baby. And uh, went all over the place, and you had some incredible people on there. You had Placebo on there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, was how, how was that? Because you guys are quite the entrepreneurs as well, because you've got all this going on. It's, it's pretty amazing. I mean, it's a big undertaking to put that show together. Um, but it's uh, this, this last um, installment of Project Revolution was, I think it was my favorite, you know. Um, we've taken out a bunch of really great bands like Cypress Hill before and Korn and Snoop Dogg and this one I really felt like we kind of out, outdone ourselves and uh, we had My Chemical Romance, Taking Back Sunday, um, Him, Placebo, Mindless Self-Indulgence. I mean these are just like some of the coolest bands ever and uh, it was really cool. The guys from Placebo by the way are like you know, some of the nicest people. They I mean, are. They really are. And they had the it's funniest. It's a crazy cat, Brian. They, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And, sure. and they had this thing, like I came out one day of the bus, and in front of the buses, there was like this little little tent, and on the front of it, it had been spray painted placebo gazebo. Oh, really? And they had made their own like little outdoor oasis <laughs> with truck stop goodies. It was really? the funniest thing, like a little gnome and a little astroturf and a and a a fence, a white picket fence that's about this tall, <laughs> all awesome. the way around it. It was so funny. It was awesome. They'd be out there barbecuing and you know, riding their bikes. It's so funny. Yeah, that's genius. So they, were they the best at sort of uh, supplying you guys with extra catering? Who was, was the best bad at sort of saying, here's, here's, here's a superb <laughs> sausage sambo? You know, uh, My Chemical Romance actually, I would have to say, were the kings of the grill um, <laughs> on this tour. Every night, like every night without fail, um, after they played, they would fire up the grills and feed everyone on tour like it seemed like really? yeah I mean anybody could go they had like endless supplies of sausages and hamburgers and hot dogs and Vegetarian whatever options. chicken yeah and they just <laughs> <laughs> that one was went this album you guys put so much into it so much heart and soul made it such a big sound really rocky and then some of the songs Chester I mean like giving up it sounds like your spleen is being ripped out through your nostrils. That's actually how we accomplished that. It's, it's oh, it weird is. how you picked that up. <laughs> I, I, I I'm a very keen error. <laughs> <laughs> I do try. Uh, it just makes me just wince just thinking about it. What, what about playing it on stage though? Is it is it night after night? Yeah, he, he doesn't have a spleen anymore. So no. Uh, I've got to just I just remember the I try I draw from that feeling. Um, no, it's uh, <laughs> it's you know when we when we did it in the studio and we do it like when we're rehearsing and everything like. Um, um, I, I sometimes will do the full scream, but normally during the show, like, my adrenaline's pumping, you know, like, I've been running around, and uh, it's hard to keep the whole 18 seconds, so I, 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 I do nine seconds and then take a quick breath and then do, do the, other, the other nine seconds. This is funny because I don't think that's, I don't think you were asking about, in particular, the one scream, but, no, but Chester's I was so hard on one. himself. Chester's so hard on himself about that thing in particular. I want to do the whole scream so do, bad. There's an 18 second, for the fans at home who know, there's an 18 second scream in the song, and he does it once in a while. Like, he's got enough breath and yeah. the adrenaline is down just enough where he can just pull it off. But for the most part, when you're like freaking out and excited and playing a show, <laughs> it's a like yeah, it's, it's it's not gonna happen. It's, it's like it's like um, run around the block as fast as you can, and then try to do like do anything with one breath for 18 seconds. seconds.